so you can see there that the ocean took away and broke the fence. So it's just coming in and just pouring into the pool here. It's so, so sad. We're packing up the truck. We are going to the beach, of course. For the past few months, we've been going like <laughs> with my family and then Mike's family, and now we're going with my family again, slash Tressa's family. We explained this in a previous vlog. This trip was for Bobby and Tressa's first trip the high wedding. It's the first trip of the high country. I'm pretty excited, so are the girls. They're loaded up, they're so ready. But Bobby and Tressa were supposed to get married on Friday. Today is Sunday. It moved to next year because of everything going on, so. We already booked this house for the whole family to go and celebrate, so we're still gonna go. I mean, no refunds on the house, so might as well go and enjoy a vacation. So, Tressa's parents came up and surprised her. That vlog should already be up. I'm gonna actually edit it on the way down. Gives me something to do in the truck. While Mike watches Air Disasters. I hate watching those because it makes me even more scared of flying, but he's like obsessed with them, so I'll just put my headphones in and edit. But yeah, we're all gonna go down to the beach. Trust his parents are coming. It's gonna be an awesome time. My dad is coming. I haven't been to the beach with my dad since I was probably like a junior or senior in high school. So it's gonna be awesome being able to go to the beach with him and his dog. So I'm really, really excited. The girls are loaded up, ready to go. <laughs> Hi. Piggy is actually really tired. <laughs> She's so over it. She's like, let's just go. Come on. I'm ready to get my nap on Savannah's really tired too. Her and I were awake all night. Piggy slept all night, but she's acting tired and cold She's shivering. It's pretty cold out, but yeah, here we go to the beach Stop at McDonald's for a little snack. Whoa, Simmy. Just a little snack. Alrighty, we made it. It is so gorgeous out. This house is insane, you guys. I cannot wait to show you. So let's let's go inside and see. It's insane. <gasps> Ooh. So this is one of the fanciest homes we've ever stayed at. Wow. This is pretty amazing so far. hot up here it's, it's a very tiny area this is like a uh, Rapunzel castle 
pretty cool though. Little section. That's a little warm. Yeah, if it wasn't hot up here, this would be like the coolest little reading area. It's actually kind of nice though, where all the hot air goes come out. Dang, it's hot up in this little Rapunzel tower. All right, so we just had some bros. Now we're gonna take all the dogs for a walk on the beach. This is Bella's first time ever at a beach, so I'm really excited to see how she reacts with the ocean. You have no idea how the harness works, babe. Look at what you're doing. You're totally not doing it right, that's for sure. Clearly. Here's Bella's first time. She's running. She's excited. Like I never saw sand before. She's so excited. Oh, there goes Boomer. Getting a movie set up for the girls. Getting the movie set up. They're gonna take a little nap while we go to the aquarium. Today it's drizzling a little bit and it's the only day it's supposed to rain, so I figured we can take everyone to the aquarium and show them it because it's so cool. And I posted a vlog months ago, like right whenever I started this channel, with some footage from there and it's it's so, so, so cool. So if you guys haven't seen that, I'm gonna post some footage from today so you can see how epic this aquarium is. I love it so much. So we're heading to the aquarium right now and we're super excited. Little otter sleep in. That is so adorable. It looks just like Peg. I know, that's what makes it 10 times cuter. I love that he's just napping in his little warm light. <laughs> Last time we were here, they were out swimming like crazy. Yeah, they were swimming all over the place. This is where they take care of all the turtles. There's one that's 170 pounds. I'm assuming that's him because he's massive. I'm assuming he's the 130 pound guy. We always compare our dogs to like other animals, I feel. So I'm like, oh, that looks like Savannah. Are we the only ones that do that? Him. Or do you guys do that too? Chess, are you gonna touch anything? Absolutely not. <laughs> Ew. Slimy. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's downstairs playing like a bunch of games and Miss Old Girl's up here just hanging out. She wanted to be up here where it's nice and quiet. She's not about the party life. Right, baby? <laughs> You're so perfect, Savannah. So we had a salmon dinner. It was so good, you guys, and I totally forgot to film it. I was too excited about the food. But we had a great time at the aquarium. Dinner was amazing, and now we're playing some game downstairs. I don't know what it's called. I'm literally having the worst brain fart right now, but I'll take you guys down and show you because we're having a great time. All right, this is a pretty intense game. 
trying to stay on the left. Oh, so close. Might be too fast. <gasps> oh my god, it hit a dead spot. So we're down at the beach, and Bella is my dad's dog, and she is freaking out anytime my dad gets into the water. She wants him to be safe. She freaks out. <laughs> she worries so much. <laughs> dad, dad, dad. Go get him, Bella. Bella loves to swim, but she's like freaking out that her dad's in the water. <laughs> All right, let's go upstairs and get some spaghetti. You ready to go get some spaghetti, girls? <laughs> Come on, man, man. My dad's been working on this all day. It's been simmering since what time this morning? Like six o'clock. Like six in the morning. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be amazing. It's a nice salad. Tons of noodles over there. My dad found a starfish this morning. And it was salty. It is so cool. I've never seen one at the Outer Banks. That's cool. All right, so we're gonna take him down to the beach because he's still alive. There he goes. Bye bye, Patrick. We made it to the golf course and it's gorgeous. It's a beautiful course. Well, first of all, let me just say, this is not the course for me or for anyone else at this party. <laughs> this is like if you actually know what you're doing. Yeah. I'm here in my Nike. This is, these are like the, this, this is the nicest outfit I brought along today, which says a lot. So we're not doing good. I mean, it is, it's so nice. We've never golfed here before, so yeah. this should be a lot of fun. I mean, Oh, it's beautiful. The clubhouse, everything. All right, babe, you're gonna nail this one. Well, we gotta drive at least like 200, which isn't that far, 220 yards to get her over the water hazard. <sighs> Bam! Get down, get down. I made it! Woo! Yeehaw! <laughs> We're at the lighthouse and there's a corgi and a corgi puppy. They're so cute. <laughs> I know. It's a little puppy. What's going on over here? A love fest. We're looking at things. What are you looking at? I'm just looking. What are you looking at, Pig? The lighthouse? I love the lighthouse. It's so pretty. Look at Michael go. Getting the right shot. <laughs> How'd it turn out? That's awesome. morning stroll. We're off to Duck Donuts. We're gonna go get donuts for everybody. bros for lunch. I get a lot of questions about bros, so I kind of wanted to let you guys know where it is because so many people want to know like what is bros and everything. This is bros right here and it is in the town Avon of the Outer Banks. It's in the little Hatteras Island shopping plaza and it's called Bros Sandwich Shack. You're definitely going to want to eat here if you come to the Outer Banks. It's, it's the best food we have ever had in our entire lives. Really we are addicted. It's the, it's the most consistent too. They never like Every, almost everywhere you go, any restaurant, there's always like, oh, that's a bad batch of chicken or whatever. There, there's never been a bad batch of anything here. It's pretty incredible. Yeah, it's pretty so good. Incredible. 
so we're about to have a really good lunch and I just wanted to let you guys know where it is because so many people are like what is bros and why should I go there and then there's other people that are like don't tell them because then everyone's gonna find out about it I don't think most people are gonna <laughs> drive all the way down here just to try it but if you do you won't be disappointed yes all right we got an awesome beach fire going we're gonna make some s'mores oh, yeah. Mike's fave he can't have a fire without s'mores Little piggy's here. She's gonna go crab hunting soon. That's her favorite. Gordon, this is a pretty crazy find. So Bobby comes up to me. He says, hey, what kind of jellyfish is this? And I don't really know my jellyfish species all that well. I know a couple from diving and whatnot, but uh, I walk up to it and I'm like, man, it, I swear that's a Portuguese man of war, but they're relatively rare around here. Sure enough, that is definitely a Portuguese man of war jellyfish Holy washed crap. up right here at the Outer Banks. Now, if you don't know about the, the man of war, extremely poisonous jellyfish uh, is deadly to, can be deadly to humans and uh, a very 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 bad species of even, jelly even after they're dead their tentacles can still sting right yeah, they, and yeah. there's a huge one right there all right well here we got the dune the dunes are now gone we had a big dune in front of the house we had a dune that was about that size there in front and uh, now it's completely gone Last day and the, Last day, the ocean though. came up and took our dune away. There was a dune there all week. Yeah, big dune, about 15 feet. But I mean, there you can see the little, pretty much we're right on the ocean. So you can see there that the ocean took away and broke the fence. So it's just coming in and just pouring into the pool here. It's so, so sad. Just stay out. Saying goodbye, unfortunately. Yeah. We are gonna go wow. get some lunch and then head home. The pool got destroyed. The pool is not looking good. So, so sad. Might be a jellyfish, right? Oh yeah, that looks like a jellyfish right there. So we're gonna go get some lunch and then head on home. It's been a great week though. The great weather. I mean, it's late October and we're, uh, you know, we've been able to go in the water every day. Yeah, that guy's chilling. Yeah, it's been amazing. I, I just love it here. Anyway, I guess we'll catch you in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.